Hi, I'm Ryan from iThingland. In this tutorial, we will teach you how to add or edit the SKU of any variable product using a very simple and quick way through the WooCommerce Block Variations Editing plugin with some examples. Let's jump straight into it. The first example is how to append some value to the SKU of one product variation. Imagine that you want to append just $50 exclamation point and regular price of each variation to the SKU of some variable products whose price is in the range of $50 to $150. The first thing you need to do is filter the variable product. So open the search form and click on the filter icon on the top of the screen and click on the pricing tab and set the price from 50 to 150. And finally, by clicking on get products, all the products whose price fall within the mentioned range will be displayed in a table. Now, mark some or all of the products in the table and then click on manage variation. And as soon as you open the variations bulk edit form, you can see a list of product variations in the table. So, in order to quickly edit the SKU of one variation, just click on the edit icon to open the bulk actions form. In the middle of this form, you can find the SKU field and there are some options in the first combo box. New which is used for setting a new value, append, which is used for adding some data or variable at the end of the current value, prepend, which is used for adding some data or variable at the beginning of the current value, delete, which is used for removing the current value, replace, which is used for removing the current value and replacing it with a new one, and clear, which is used for clearing the filter. As we mentioned at the beginning of this tutorial, we want to append some data to the current values of the SKU, so obviously, the append option will give us the perfect result. In the text box, you can manually put any data to be added to the SKU. For instance, we're going to put just $50 exclamation point. The last box related to the SKU is the variable box which consists of a list of the most popular data in WooCommerce that you may need to assign to the SKU of a variation. To fulfill the aim of this tutorial, we're going to click on regular price from the list and you can see that this data has been added to the text box next to just $50 exclamation mark. Now you just need to click on the do block button. And so let's go and check out the new SKU. In this table, if I click on show variations, you will see that in the SKU column, just $50 is added to the product. And as you can see, we can do the same thing for some other variations too. Example number two, replacing the current value of the SKU assigned to some variations with the ID and regular price. In this example, we're going to show you how to bulk edit the SKU of some variations at the same time in our plugin by using the edit icon at the top of the table. So go to manage variations and select the variations the stocks of which you want to change now if you click on the edit icon you will see two options in this example we're going to go for the selected variations option you can see the same bulk actions form that we described in example one now to replace the ID in the current value of the SKU assigned to the selected variations by sale price, 
you just need to select replace in the condition box select ID from the variable box of the first row and select same case from the first drop down list in the second row and then select regular price in the variable box and finally click on the do bulk button and congratulations you have successfully replaced the SKU with the desired values now let's check out the new result please note that if you choose all variations of all selected products and go through the same steps the ID in all of the SKUs related to all selected products will be replaced by the regular price.